Hi. As a field service provider, you'll want to focus on your customers because they are the lifeblood of your business. From the customer's view and reach out, you're able to view a customer's entire history with you and book new work orders or audits for them. In fact, you can track all your customer interactions from within the customer's view. Here's, for example, a list of customers and we might get a call from one of them and uh, quickly we can search for their name, pull up, uh, pull up their record, and now look at the customer details associated with them and we can get a good sense of what's been happening in the short uh, recent past. All of the calls that we have with the uh, customer can be recorded here. First off, we have uh, the basics contact information, including the customer ID number. Uh, we're showing three different locations for this, for this customer. Uh, here they are listed uh, in, in a table way, but you can also see them on the map above. Uh, here you have different tabs that show the number of tickets, the number of inspections, the number of work orders, and any invoices that uh, are, are now being worked on for this customer. Uh, I can also have a look at uh, the different sites uh, that are associated with a location. So here not only do we have three locations, but each location might have two multiple sites. And those sites might have what we call entities. Entities are just a further refinement of perhaps something that you want to use as a inspection object. So for example, the five entities here are all listed here as forklifts of various uh, with the various uh, names, and they're located at uh, the two uh, sites, uh, Warehouse B and Warehouse A, all at the same location. So, you have a very rich way to describe uh, the, the customer and the associated um, elements that you'll be working with with that customer as you do inspections and audits and as you take calls for, uh, from a call center. Uh, incidents and calls can be recorded as a ticket. That's very straightforward.